the James Webb Space Telescope has unveiled a revelation that's as mesmerizing as it is unsettling. Scientists now report that galaxies forming shortly after the cosmic dark ages appear eerily similar to our own Milky Way mirror-like twins scattered across the infant universe. Even more shocking is their sheer abundance during the universe's first billion years, a finding that throws a wrench into our long-standing models of a slow, orderly cosmic evolution. As researchers continue to peer deeper into the universe's beginnings, the surprises only grow more intense. Not only are they finding more galaxies than ever imagined, but the sheer scale and repetition suggests something truly bewildering, as if the universe is reflecting back at us, showing a duplicate of itself near the dawn of time. These discoveries are causing scientists to question the very nature of the cosmos. Is there a true beginning? Is the universe following any predictable path at all? According to Leo Shamir, associate professor at Kansas State University, the new data is deeply unsettling. He explains that rather than revealing a universe in its infancy, the James Webb Telescope has shown us vast, mature galaxies where we expected to see cosmic toddlers, an enigma that challenges everything we thought we knew. If the Big Bang happened the way scientists have long believed, then what we're seeing now is downright mind-bending because some of these newly discovered galaxies appear to be older than the universe itself. Just take a look at this, a galaxy so astonishing it's leaving astronomers stunned. Meet Ju Long, a groundbreaking discovery made possible by the James Webb Space Telescope. This isn't just any galaxy, it's a fully formed spiral galaxy, and it holds the title of the oldest spiral galaxy ever detected in the early universe. What's so shocking? Ju Long existed when the universe was only about a billion years old practically a cosmic newborn compared to its current age of 13.8 billion years. And here's where things get really wild. Galaxies like Ju Long, especially elegant spiral ones with clearly defined arms, aren't supposed to show up so early. According to everything we thought we knew, these structures take billions of years to evolve, gradually pieced together through chaotic mergers and galactic collisions. Yet Julong defies all of that. It already boasts a mature structure, a central bulge brimming with ancient stars, a luminous disk where new stars are forming, and those signature spiral arms, eerily similar to our own Milky Way. That's why scientists are calling it the most distant Milky Way look-alike ever discovered. Its size, shape, and stellar mass simply don't add up when measured against our current models of the universe's evolution. Mengyuan Xiao, the lead author of the study and a postdoctoral researcher at the University of Geneva, put it best. What sets Ju Long apart is how closely it mirrors the Milky Way, not just in appearance, but in scale and structure. Even though it predates our galaxy by billions of years, Ju Long could easily be mistaken for the Milky Way's cosmic sibling. Recent research estimates that Ju Long's star-forming disk spans an impressive 60,000 light years, smaller than the Milky Way's diameter, but still massive for such an ancient galaxy. It also holds roughly 100 billion solar masses worth of stars, compared to our galaxy's 1.5 trillion. Despite being smaller, Zhu Long is still the largest Milky Way doppelganger ever spotted this early in cosmic history. And the wildest part? It's not alone. Zhu Long is just one of several spiral galaxies discovered in the early universe that look startlingly like our own Milky Way. One example is Ceres 2112, found by the James Webb Space Telescope back in 2023. That galaxy, lies 11.7 billion light-years away, which means we're seeing it as it was when the universe was incredibly young. Yet it had already formed that distinctive, elegant spiral structure we usually associate with much older galaxies. And the surprises don't stop there. 
scientists recently uncovered another colossal galaxy from the same early era, one that resembles a giant wheel-shaped version of the Milky Way. Webb's data indicates this isn't just a fluke. There may be dozens more mature-looking spiral galaxies hiding in the early universe. The discovery of Long adds to this growing cosmic puzzle. These galaxies defy our understanding of how the universe evolved. According to the standard model, galaxies like ours should take billions of years to mature. Our own Milky Way took nearly 13 billion years to reach its current form. So how are we spotting lookalikes less than 1 billion years after the Big Bang? It's a question that's keeping cosmologists up at night. Why does the early universe seem to reflect the structure of today's cosmos? Are we staring at cosmic twins, formed impossibly fast? Or is something fundamentally wrong with our timeline of galaxy formation? Whatever the answer, these discoveries are forcing scientists to rethink the rules of the universe and rewrite parts of the cosmic story we thought we already knew. But wait, just when we thought the cosmic revelations couldn't get any more astonishing, the James Webb Space Telescope has dropped another bombshell. In a brand new study, scientists report they've uncovered galaxies that seem to exist far earlier than we ever imagined possible. According to their findings, Webb has spotted galaxies at redshift values beyond 15, and potentially even hitting 20. To put that into perspective, redshift is essentially a cosmic time machine. The higher the redshift, the further back in time we're looking. So, redshifts of 15 to 20 mean we're glimpsing galaxies as they appeared when the universe was just around 100 million years old, an instant after the Big Bang. In this groundbreaking analysis, the research team pulled 10 objects from Webb's Astro Deep catalog, each exhibiting the right signatures to suggest they lie at redshift Z equals 15 to 20. If confirmed, these are not just ancient galaxies, they're some of the very first structures ever to light up the cosmos. And here's the mind-blowing part. If these galaxies truly are that old, it means they formed at lightning speed just a few million years after the universe itself was born. This timeline flies in the face of current scientific theory, which says galaxies shouldn't be able to form that fast, let alone spiral into well-organized structures so quickly. Naturally, the scientific community is treating this with cautious curiosity. Experts are calling for high-precision spectroscopic tests to verify the true distances and ages of these mysterious objects. But if the findings hold up, it could rewrite the story of the universe's birth and early evolution, shaking the pillars of modern cosmology. And that's not all. In the same wave of discoveries, astronomers Cosmin Eli, Gillian Palin, and Catherine Fries may have stumbled upon something even stranger, dark stars. In their infrared observations using Webb, they identified three objects that looked like galaxies, but might not be. Instead, they could be something entirely different. Dark stars, theoretical cosmic beasts thought to exist in the universe's earliest era, around 200 million years after the Big Bang. So, what exactly is a dark star? Unlike ordinary stars powered by nuclear fusion, these early giants may have been fueled by dark matter annihilation, radiating energy in a completely alien way. Long considered hypothetical, dark stars are now edging toward reality thanks to these stunning new findings, and if confirmed, we may be peering at the very first lights of the cosmos, radically different from anything we've ever known. Imagine a star, not powered by the familiar force of nuclear fusion, but instead fueled by dark matter. At its heart lies a dense concentration of dark matter particles colliding and annihilating each other. But rather than releasing energy outward like normal stars, the products of this annihilation stay trapped inside, feeding the star from within. 
These are the mysterious dark stars, a bizarre and theoretical class of objects that may have existed in the universe's earliest days. And thanks to the James Webb Space Telescope, we might finally be seeing them for real. But that's not the only cosmic mystery Webb has thrown at us. Its latest observations have revealed something far more unsettling. The universe may not be expanding uniformly. The rate at which the universe expanded in its earliest moments appears to differ from the expansion rate we observe in the nearby present-day universe. This puzzling discrepancy, what scientists refer to as cosmic tension, is getting harder to ignore. And it leads to a mind-bending question. What if the universe doesn't have a single, fixed age? What if time itself flows differently depending on where you look? That possibility shakes the very foundation of cosmology. If this cosmic tension is real, it suggests that our methods of measuring the universe's age and growth could be fundamentally flawed. And if that's the case, then our understanding of the Big Bang, the timeline of galaxy formation, and even the fabric of space-time may need to be completely rethought. Just a few years ago, scientists believed the early universe was a quiet, empty void, a pitch-black expanse with no stars or galaxies for hundreds of millions of years. But the James Webb Space Telescope has completely flipped that narrative. It has spotted fully formed galaxies, some with spiral arms and disk structures remarkably like the Milky Way, appearing just a few hundred million years after the Big Bang, during what was once believed to be the cosmic dark ages. And now, paired with the revelation that the universe may be expanding in a non-uniform way, the implications are profound and a bit unsettling. If the universe is older in some places and younger in others, then the Big Bang as we understand it may not be the singular, well-defined beginning we once thought it was. These revelations are pushing scientists toward bold, new theories that could redefine our cosmic origin story. With every glimpse deeper into the universe, Webb isn't just showing us the past, it's forcing us to rewrite the future of cosmology itself. Some scientists, including Nobel Prize-winning physicist Roger Penrose, believe our universe may actually be the rebirth of a previous one, a cosmic phoenix rising from the ashes of an earlier reality. Others entertain the idea of a mirror universe, one that may have existed before the Big Bang, reflecting our own in ways we've yet to understand. And then there are those who take it a step further, suggesting the universe never had a beginning at all, that it has always existed in one form or another. Even more radical theories propose that what we perceive as the expansion of the universe might be an illusion, a trick of our limited perspective. And the forces we've long blamed for shaping the cosmos, dark matter and dark energy, might not even be real. These are no longer just science fiction ideas. They're serious questions, sparked by the groundbreaking discoveries of the James Webb Space Telescope. And with that, we've reached the end of this cosmic journey. But the universe? Its story is just beginning to unfold. If you found it interesting and informative, let us know your thoughts in the comments. We'd love to hear from you. Also, if you'd like to support our work, you can do so by donating via Super Thanks. Your support helps us create more amazing content. Thank you for watching.